A Kansas congressional candidate for the 2nd District is explaining why he is continuing to move forward with giving away an AR-15 rifle. Investigators say the same style gun was used in a shooting this week at a high school in Florida where 17 people were killed. Our Capitol Bureau Chief Courtney Ryan talked to the candidate today and explains his reasoning. Courtney? Tyler Tannenhill tells me he started this giveaway in order to promote himself ahead of this week's Republican convention taking place in Wichita. It was this giveaway on Facebook that sparked backlash. About a month ago, we, we planned it out, and earlier this week on Tuesday, we did the launch. Raffling off an AR-15 rifle. I do believe in the Second Amendment. Um, I, you know, I, I stand for it in the hard times and the bad times. This is clearly a difficult time for a lot of people. According to law enforcement, an AR-15 rifle was used in a deadly school shooting this week in Florida. And Tannehill admits the tragedy there has led to more attention on his campaign and raffle. Obviously, we don't want the name recognition based off Florida. Um, you know, we, we want every one of those individuals back um, instead of the name recognition. But, you know, it has got my name out there. Tannehill has faced a lot of criticism online. One post from Wednesday has more than a thousand comments calling him tone deaf and the giveaway poor judgment. But the Marine veteran stands behind the giveaway. We had that discussion on, on if we keep it up or take it down. Um, and as a campaign, we decided to keep it up to, to move forward with the discussion. Um, there's been a lot of backlash, but we've also got a lot of support. The Republican candidate says he hopes this starts a discussion. How do we adhere to our Second Amendment, letting um, le people have legal gun ownership while, while protecting our students? Tannehill tells me that he is still going to move forward with this giveaway. He says you'll have to be a legal gun owner in order to be awarded it. Live at the Capitol, I'm Courtney Ryan. All right, thank you, Courtney.